no, 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 oh, there we go. Well, this will take all of you down, so enjoy the nice bolt to the face. And there you go. Wow, well, no, one guy lived. He's just, he's just the coolest guy. Look at that thing. It's, wow, that is, wow, you're poopy. You're like those scums. That must be, like, the guy that I was just, yeah, you're dead now, aren't you? Yeah, you are. What a boss. That scotch guy, he's done. He was the man, and then I took him down. I was like, I'm, man can't take me. I'm taking down the man. Well, these guys are poopy compared to those guys I fought. Wow, they just died. I just killed them, and their bodies disappeared. Well, works for me, and that guy's gone, so I guess I get to leave. Sebulon! Dun 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 dun. Herpeter! We've gotta help Fantasia. Hey, don't you care about how I am? Never mind, let's go. Okay, I was going to, but. Uh, never mind. This guy's probably raping her. Because he's a creepy pervert. Ooh! Come on, come on, don't be so shy! I don't know why he has like a oogie boogie voice. Y yes. But Mr. Don, I'd like to explain something to me first. Of course, my dear. I'll take you through it slowly, step by step, so come on. That's weird. No, that's not what I meant. No, stop, just just wait a second. Come on, come on. I Oh, I can't wait any longer. Here comes Papa. That guy's really awkward. Zebulon! <laughs> huh. What? What the? Who goes there? I'm sorry, Don. Get what? Shut up. We're here asking the questions now. What did your assistants find out? Talk! If you don't tell us... <laughs> Got a little captain in you. I'll chop them off. Whoa! <laughs> don't! Not that! I'll talk! I'll tell you everything! So talk. I made him find out where the man with the gun arm was. But that's that's what I was ordered to do. Mm. By who? No. If I told you that, I'd be killed. Talk if you don't tell us. I'll rip them off. Ah, it was Hedgar of Shenra. Hedgar, Hedgar, the head of public safety maintenance. Ah, no, uh, that guy's not doing a very good job. I saw the latter job, and it wasn't very good. They don't tell us. We're all leaning on the bed. I'll smash them. Ah, oh, oh boy. I'm not fooling around here either, you know. Shinra's trying to crush a small rebel group called Avalanche and want to infiltrate their hideout. And they're really going to crush them, literally, by breaking the support holding up the plate above them. Break the support? You know what's going to happen. The plate will go ping, and everything's going to go bam. I heard that the hideout's in the Sector 7 slums. I'm just glad it's not here in Sector 6. They're going to wipe out the Sector 7 slums? Zebulon, will you come with me to Sector 7? Of course, Herpeter. Uh, not after I check that dresser. Just, just a second. Shut up. No, wait. I'll only take a second. How do you think scum like me feels when they babble on about the truth? They'll, they've pretty much given up on life. They're sure they'll win. They don't know. Uh, sure. Close, but no cigar. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm a scumbag. You're just a scum lord, you know that? I really hope there's a save point soon. Whoa, where's this located? Well, that looks like a man in uniform. And that guy looks like a Lego guy. He looks like a Star Trek guy. Ooh, look at me. President Shinra. How are the prep How are the preparations going? <laughs> smoothly, very smoothly. I signed the text of this. President, are, are we really going to do this? Simply destroy a group with only a few members? What's the problem, Reeve? Do you want out? No. But as head of the Urban Development Department, I've been involved in the building and running of Midgar, that's why. Reeve, you should flush those personal problems in the morning. The mayor's against this anyway. Oh, look at that guy, Stalin. Eh, mayor? <laughs> He just sits in this building all day feeding his face. You still call that a mayor? Uh, now if you'll excuse me, sir. Eh, mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta lean back and walk. 
<sighs> You're tired. Why don't you take a couple of days off and go somewhere? <sighs> Fine. Uh, well, everything seems to be going smoothly. We'll destroy Sector 7 and report that Avalanche did it. And we'll send in the rescue operation care of Shinra Incorporated. <laughs> this is perfect. What a scum board. I don't think they get much scummier than that guy. Hopefully there's a save point somewhere. Can I get that from here? Nope. You alright? Yeah. You alright? Man, that's just terrible. I was actually trying to use the ladder. I didn't even know I was supposed to... <clears throat> supposed to pick those people up. Maybe not. Oh, jeez. Loud noises. I'm hearing some rock music, so I'm thinking there might be a... Yeah! I'm gonna go out on a limb and say he's a boss. Yeah. I'm gonna seal evil on that guy so we can't use any magic. Okay. That seems like something that should have happened. Seal evil! Take that. You've been sealed. Ha ha. Oh. Dun -na 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 -na. 91 damage. Take that. Punch. Cross slash. Wow. Seal evil must paralyze him too. I didn't know that. Yeah. Now what are you doing? You're just standing there looking dumb. Pretty sure. I don't. I'm pretty sure. Did I ever equip the mithril rod to that person? I think I did. Yeah, it looks like she has a different weapon, so... But, I don't know what the deal is there. I like how this guy's not doing anything because of my attacks paralyzing him. This is pretty nice, especially since he's taken a lot of hits and isn't dead yet. It's pretty nice. Of course, when he starts moving, he's just gonna be like, Yep, we're gonna go rape Bill on you. Yeah! On. He's starting to recoil a little bit. I don't know if that means he's about to unparalyze. Come on. Yep, he unparalyzed. Now he's just going all nasty all over the place. Bolt on that. That guy right there. Yep, ready for this bolt. Mm -hmm. Boom. Wow, this guy's a lot of health. I don't know how much I like that. Yeah. I don't know if that person does 49 twice or... If it's just supposed to be like just 49 damage. Sewer tsunami. That must is that the thing that he just did before? Yep. All right. There you go. 183 to himself. Good job. He did way more. Unless that heals him, but I think it'd be green if he healed himself. So I feel like this guy's just an idiot. Attack. Kill him. Feel free to kill him. No. Okay. Never mind. Joke. Oh, this looks good. Mm-hmm. Well. Oh, that's good. Can I use a... Ah, yes. Limit breaker. Good. Good, good, good. Ah, oh, he died. Okay. dun 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 I better get some good experience for him. At least 300, because... Otherwise, I'm gonna be... Dang. 240! Okay. Right. That's some poopy experience. Got one Phoenix down for beating that guy. So, there you go. It's too late. Marlene Garbanzo people of the slums. Don't give up. Never give up hope. It's not easy to destroy the pillar, right? Yeah, you're right. We still have time. Alright. Let's get that item. Let's go up here. Yeah. And I guess I'm gonna have to walk across this thing somehow. Eh. Oh no, there's stairs down there, though. Alright, go down the stairs. Or ladder. Go up these stairs. Oh, there's stairs. Oh, wow, I feel like an idiot. There's an item here, isn't there? Steel materia. So now I can thief things, apparently. I'm just that good. I can't believe I didn't even notice those stairs there. I was just like, I'm the ladder. So we're gonna get this item. After finding a monster, obviously. It wouldn't be. Oh, great. I hate it when there's multiple enemies because then it just sets it up for being scummy. Yep, hit. Fire! Wow, I did like nothing. I did nothing. Fire! Well, I did a lot of damage to those guys, and he still didn't die. That's good. Well, I killed one or two. And I, yeah, apparently I can't count. Two of them died. I guess I killed one. 
<sighs> blade beam, look at that, he's... I'm gonna have to take the gander blade beam. Go up these stairs. Give me this item. Oh, it's just a potion. So let me see this. Wait. Wait, let me... Let me, let me check. No! Let me check. Thank you. Diffuses after hitting one opponent. Well, I'm gonna let my limit get, you know, let me get another limit breaker in before I switch to that tier 2 limit breaker attack things because I am almost ready to do a limit breaker attack and they're pretty nifty, so. Up the stairs and into this trapdoor of doom. Let's try and jump down. Let's not. <laughs> I didn't know if I wanted to jump, jump, jump down that. Looks like it could be a little nasty. I can go up that. What is the green thing? Oh, does that mean I can, like, climb up it over here? Alright then. That's kind of nifty. It's like, oh, you can climb up this. Up the ladder. And into the surface world. Alright, where am I? Alright, that makes sense. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and, and save after this freaking business is gonna. Fantasia, I got you mixed up in all the sorts. Don't tell me to go home. Alright, whatever. Let's see, if we can just get past the trains that are all lit up, we should be able to get out here. Get out of here. Well, oh my gosh! <laughs> Like a foot from the save point, I have to find some enemies. I'm just running. I've never even run from a battle. Okay, I don't even know how you run in this game. But apparently it's not the way that you run in every other... The way that Brad told me to run doesn't work. Which, now he's gonna change his story and tell me that he told me a different thing. It's lies. It just doesn't work. L2R2 at the same time doesn't do anything. Oh, nine, you're good. I'm gonna push over, you know, that little swamp rat thing. Wow, he has a lot of health for so tiny. Yeah, I won. Yep. All in a day's work. Up, up. Grab a ball. That's up. Hope you guys enjoyed this installation of Final Fantasy VII. I would like to say I enjoyed playing. And it is pretty fun, despite how scummy the game is overall. But, hope you enjoyed the session, and I hope to see you guys in the next episode of Final Fantasy VII. So, I'm Lisa Waffle, and I'm out. See you guys next time.